Robin brings probably the ultimate package of understanding of what we do, passion for the industry, passion for our students, and a real appreciation of the work of the legislators. So she brings that together and she can make a cogent argument and a cogent case, whether it's state funding, whether it's an amendment to a bill, whether it's educating a staffer on the value proposition of our university. Robin brings it together and she packages it in a way that our legislators can understand it and own it and make it their own and help us both succeed. Robin is a problem solver. She's someone that is really trustworthy and having that right combination of being knowledgeable, being trustworthy, and being a creative problem solver is not always easy to get and she has that right combination of skills. Robin is extraordinarily adept in terms of her understanding of the issues. Uh, what I value most as a public policy professional and academic myself is her resolve to make sure that when she walks into the room and she's seated at the table with decision makers, that she has done the work and the research to make sure that she's the most knowledgeable person in the room. And she does that with great humility such that no one else knows that except for her. She is very much engaged and involved and brings her best self to everything that she uh, engages in. She's able to come into the room and talk about something like higher education, understanding that they only have a limited amount of time, uh, that the issue is critical and that they must be able to uh, comprehend it in a short period of time, and she's able to work on doing that. And I think that comes from her complex experiences, you know, and varied experiences that she's had in deconstructing difficult information and complex information. She's very selfless. She just thinks of how can I help the most people as possible. She's always looking around at her colleagues in the state and looking how can I help higher ed in New Jersey? How can I help the industry overall? Robin is the ultimate collaborator, which is a great thing. Um, she's someone who doesn't come with a predetermined notion of what the outcome should be. She's someone who tries to build consensus and always have the mindset of trying to get to yes, meaning everyone has a yes and win-win situation. And I think that is instrumental in how we craft good public policy, recognizing that there's no monopoly on good ideas and utilizing good sound reasoning to get to a good conclusion. Well, Robin's unique. She's Robin. She's got this bubbly personality. She's got this intense work ethic. She has a very strong family values and she believes that her purpose is to do good work for people. Professional. Professional. Consummate professional. And there's a lot of words that folks can use about her, but she is genuine. There's no misnomers, there's no ambiguity. Like, she is who she is. And, and, and she presents herself in such a way that when you look at her and you engage with her, you know you're getting the unvarnished truth, sometimes whether you want to hear it or not. I think Robin's skill uh, her expectations around her own work ethic and how that drives everything that she does. Excellence is always the watchword. Lovely. Kind. Caring. Caring. Compassionate. Heartwarming is, I see her and you know, you take a breath. <laughs> and she makes you feel better, you know, just by, just by her presence. When she says she's committed to something, she's all in. She's dedicated to the work that she does, and she chooses to only do good things. She's always very calm, she's always prepared, and she's always very clear about what the needs of Thomas Edison State University are. Robin has a different situation in terms of you know, Thomas Edison and its distinctiveness. And to be able to convey the message of, of what they are able to accomplish uh, without actually meeting a student, that they are providing a real service to be able to you know, encourage people who never finish their degree or encourage people to be able to go on with further degrees or to get a second degree. This is what Robin was able to really convey. Thomas Edison is here in Trenton and it is one of our proudest state institutions. Robin understands the inextricable connection between higher ed and the business community. So she positions the university as the feeder of the future workforce for the private sector. And that is what the universe, that's what they're in business to do. And she gets that and she wears that on her sleeve and it's just awesome to work with her because 
She didn't have to learn that. She came already prepared with that. Robin is a highly credible voice for the higher education community and can express very clearly what the connections are between higher education and the business community. She's very involved in the community, in various communities across the state. She's super knowledgeable about higher education, about just how it connects to economic development in the state, and how we can really be successful. So I see her not as someone that is advocating just on behalf of a particular college, but really on behalf of what we need in the state. And so I see her as a resource in that way. She's really fun to work with and really open-minded, which makes it a very stress-free, fun environment at the end of the day, always working with Robin. Congratulations, Robin, on this well-deserved award. Robin, congratulations on this incredibly well-deserved award. It is an honor for me to be able to say to you, congratulations, Godspeed continue in your good work. The state of New Jersey is just lucky to have you as somebody who is advocating on behalf of students and institutions in higher education. We can't be more proud of you to be such a distinguished awardee. Congratulations on such an extraordinary feat, uh, an accomplishment and milestone in your historic professional career. I have 226,000 constituents, but tonight my favorite one is Robin Walton. Congratulations, my friend. You are just a phenomenal woman, and I wish I could be there with you, but since I can't be, allow me to say thank you very much for everything that you do every day. Robin, congratulations on being this year's Marvin D. Swede Johnson Achievement Award winner. I cannot think of a better recipient.